I'm Linda Hawk, and I invented the Spruce Waiter Spur, and I wanted to tell you today why I designed it. I have a lifetime of working with the thoroughbreds and the more sensitive horses, like Bug here, who's an ex-quarter horse barrel racer. And when we were using the traditional spur, this is your classic Prince of Wales, and you're teaching these horses the lateral work, move over, the leg heel, get into your corners better, and the overreaction you would get, ears back, tail swishing, kicking out perhaps. And the amateur riders, they need some kind of a spur, let's say, to help them with that lateral work, but they're afraid to wear a traditional spur, again, for that overreaction. And I thought there has to be a kinder way of asking without getting that kind of negative reaction. So I had a prototype made of what is now this Persuader Spur, and I thought it had to be a bigger contact surface. The Prince of Wales, most common spur, people think because it's tiny and small, it's not offensive, but it really has that poke and jab feel. So with a bigger contact surface, no sharp edges, it's more of a push. And that's what these sensitive guys are looking for. They're not looking to be poked and jabbed. This Persuader Spur curves six degrees in, so with your correct leg position and your horse's sides bulge out, you'll make that full contact with that disc surface without having to change your leg position. Check out my website, www.spersuader.com. Lots of product reviews, testimonials, and you'll find out what tax stores carry this Persuader Spur. Go check them out. Your horse will thank you.